सो आई हैव फाइनली रीच द दुबई एक्सपो 2020 सो आर होटल इज हियर डियरा सिटी सेंटर सो वी टू का मेट्रो विच कम्स ऑल द वे डाउन टू Dubai Expo 2020. So it's it's. I heard Dubai Expo 2020 is uh, constructed on a barren land, like in a plain desert. So I'll show you everything about uh, uh, Dubai Expo 2020 and what are the information you need and what is the hack to get free Dubai Expo 2020 tickets. So once again, this uh, I've travelled through metro. No need to take a cab. So directly from our hotel point, Adira City Centre, to Dubai Expo 2020 stop. So I'll show. I'll give you all the details as as I go. So please keep watching my vlogs. Welcome to Dubai Expo 2020. The flags of all country. Country, where is India? Where is India? It's very difficult to notice. I think that is India. So there is three main counters. One is opportunity, one is mobility, and one is sustainability. Official store of Dubai Expo 2020. Wow. This is the doom where the light shows happen in the evening. So this is the very anticipated show in the entire Dubai Expo 2020. Wow! This is the light show I was talking about. This is where the light shows are going to happen. It's going to be really, really wonderful. I'm really waiting for the evening show. So that way is the entry. So if you just come down here, you get this doom. So when you stand in near the doom in the evening, you'll get to see all the all the show, all the light show that I'm talking about. So we're getting into the Dubai Opera. That's what it's called. Dubai Opera, the first Emirati opera to happen in UAE. Mainly about uh, UAE, Mr. Muhammad Fareed, who's a very famous composer. Okay. We grabbed only three minutes to show you because the show is over in Dubai Opera, and now they are doing the morning show. Okay, okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. Which helps you navigate uh, inside the Dubai Expo. Now we are trying to go to the UK Pavilion. Uh, love for Chelsea Football Club. I wasn't able to visit uh, UK in uh, the country UK and uh, visit Stamford Bridge. The Indian Pavilion has a lot of rush. So now we are going heading to the UK Pavilion. So through these maps, you can um, it navigates to the exact place where uh, the UK Pavilion is. So that's where we are headed. Can you have a pavilion? Can you go? Yeah. There's no, I don't know, I, I don't know any culture or any background about Kenyan uh, Luxembourg. Luxembourg is having a lot of queue. So 
So Luxembourg Pavilion is having a lot of queue. So Kenya Pavilion is empty. <laughs> oh, UK Pavilion is having a lot of rush. See there? So we're definitely going to skip UK Pavilion. The rush is humongous. Yeah, there's a lot of queue for the UK Pavilion. Yeah, it's going to take some time. We don't have so much time to visit Pavilion standing in the queue. So I'm just going to cover whichever pavilions are empty and easily accessible. Yeah, UK Pavilion is, it's really good, but Oh, superb UK Pavilion, love for Stamford Bridge, love for Chelsea Football Club This is something called DP World. We exactly don't know which country's pavilion is this, right? Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need what you need We're broken, it's tragic We're not all elastic But maybe there's magic Believe you could have it And I know of sadness The anxious in panic The infinite vastness Of all that is blackness Wow, 
amazing. See, this is look if you're moving away from it in the pod. If you want to travel uh, in Dubai Expo in a train, in a mode of transport, this is the perfect thing to do. So you can just hop into this one of these trains and you can travel across Dubai Expo. So this is a free of transport. So you just need to know the pick up and the drop points and then travel. This is the Chinese pavilion, this is the Belarus pavilion and this is the Austrian pavilion. So I'm looking, actually I'm looking for um, the Expo Passport. So Expo Passport is just like an, it's uh, it's the concept of a normal passport where you can go to all the counters and you can get the stamp done. So it's more of a souvenir and a memory than anything else. So I'm looking for the uh, Expo Passport, the yellow color passport. So I'll just show you guys in a minute how it looks and I really want to get my hands on, on it. Mm -hmm. 